properties of materials. Let's recap. What are materials? Materials are the matter that objects are made from, such as wood, metal, glass, rubber, fabric, stone and plastic. So what are the properties of materials? The properties describe the qualities of an object such as colour, shape, size, temperature, weight, appearance and feel. Let's look at some different properties we can use to describe different materials and objects. Colour. An object can be multiple colours, just like these yellow and white rubber boots or this white and red wooden barn. The colour can also give us a clue as to what material it's made from, like this brown table made from wood, or these silver keys made from metal. How the object feels is also a property. It may be soft, like this fabric couch, or hard, like this wooden table, smooth, like this balloon, or rough, like this stone bird bath. Appearance. If an object is transparent, it means it is see-through, like a magnifying glass or a window. If an object is opaque, it means it is not see-through, like this bucket. Shiny refers to the light reflection on an object, whereas dull means lacking brightness or sheen. If an object is rigid, it is stiff and holds its shape. Flexible means it can be bent and twisted. Stretchy indicates something can be stretched easily, like a pair of trousers or a shirt. Squashy can be easily crushed or squeezed into different shapes. When an object is waterproof, water cannot get through it, so items that need to hold water in, such as bottles and buckets, or keep water out, such as raincoats, need to be waterproof. Absorbent, on the other hand, means that it soaks up liquid easily, so sponges and clothing will usually be absorbent. Other properties may include Fragile, meaning it breaks easily Durable, which means it will last a long time without breaking and heavy and light, describing the weight of an object. Let's test your knowledge. Can you name some properties of this skateboard? These are some of the words you may have come up with. Brown, black, yellow, hard, rigid, light, waterproof, opaque, smooth, rough, dull, shiny. Did you think of any other properties? So why do we need to know about the properties of materials? The reason we need to know about materials properties is because these different properties make materials more suitable for different purposes. Take this t-shirt for example. It's made out of fabric because fabric is stretchy, soft and light, which makes it suitable to be worn. If a shirt was made out of wood, it would be hard, rigid and heavy. Would this be very comfortable? Mmm, no. What about this cup? It is made out of plastic because plastic is waterproof, durable and rigid, so the water stays in the cup. If this cup was made out of fabric, it would be soft so it wouldn't keep its shape absorbent so all the water would go through it. You see, this is why we need to know about materials and their properties. Can you have a go at identifying properties? Find an object around your house or classroom and see how many properties you can come up with. Thank you for learning all about the properties of materials with me. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. And don't forget to check out the other videos on my channel. See you soon.